So how does your home create a sense of belonging with you, your family, your community, and maybe some complete total other strangers. That happens to be one of my great passions, great callings, is we have a sense that that is what we are supposed to do with our life, our business, and our home. So I wanna show you one key space in our home to illustrate three ways, three things, I think your house, your home, your condo, your apartment or whatever can do to really enhance your connection with other people. So for a lot of people, home is where you go to get away from people. It's where you rest, it's where you recover, and that's okay, I'm not judging that. But I wanna to talk to you about how it can create a lot of connection. We built this space right here with a lot of that in mind. So I'm standing in what would be a living room, fireplace, couches, sitting area. I'm moving now into what would be our dining room. And as you can tell, it's not really a separate room. It's a separate space. We framed it in on these two windows. This would be dining, that would be living. And then over here, you probably can't tell yet, but this would be kitchen. This is walking travel space. This is our big kitchen island. I'm now standing at the sink. I've got cabinetry and countertops, refrigerators and freezers. My family loves to eat. We love to cook for and share with our friends, our neighbors, our friends from church, the families of our kids, sports team people. So we love to eat. We love to invite people in. We'll make homemade pasta together. We'll make family spaghetti recipes. We would like to not only cook, but cook together with friends. We do that all the time. There's an outdoor kitchen going in out there so that we can smoke delicious meats and enjoy that with friends. But we don't invite people just to eat at the end. We invite them to come and hang out while we do those things. Then we would say, come and eat with us. Spend some time in the dining room. We eat together almost every single night at the table with family. Very little formality about forks and knives. We sit together six nights a week probably. Talk about the day enjoy our time together and we like to invite other people into that kids friends our family our closest friends and sometimes some acquaintances on the edge of our friendship circle to invite them in more and then certainly longer evenings weekends we enjoy some of those long meaningful conversations and sometimes just silliness and hanging out which is what happens here at least that's the plan obviously we have not done that yet here but this one space was dreamt up in my head 20 years ago and now we're beginning to put it together so that we can connect with others we can have that impact on our neighborhood our church our kids schools our business i want to have team members from work here parties here which we have done in the past on a smaller scale but designing this space to do that is something we're doing and you could do too you don't have to build the custom space for it but your home when thought about differently can be an incredible way for you to invest in relationships with your spouse your children their friends their friends families your business your work associates and really live a deeper more rich life and let your home help you do that